Hi, I'm Linda Ray from Real Estate One, right on Main Street in Rochester and beyond. Uh, I'm here with Rachel today. Rachel's a very VIP to me, and I'm going to share with you why and how she can help you. Rachel, hi. It's hi. 2021. Can you believe it? I know. How oh, fast time flies. I didn't think we were going to make it, did you? <laughs> we did. But it's <laughs> going to be matters. a better year. Yep. It's going to be a better year. We know that, right? We're, we're going to believe that. So uh, what I want to talk to the public about is uh, there's going to be a lot of changes uh, in 2021. There's already been a lot of changes for people financially. Rachel is, is a bookkeeper and she does my bookkeeping for my CPA. Is that correct? Yep. So uh, I want to explain that just a little bit too, is the fact that you really prep my books for the CPA, which saves me time and money, right? And absolutely, you know, Linda's on the run all the time. So somebody has to keep the facts out there. I hate paperwork, but I love the sales and to make it all happen. So that's why I have a good team and I have uh, staff to, to be able to do that. And Rachel's been doing my books for a while. And trust me, if she can do mine, she can do yours. So the fact is, is that a lot of people in all seriousness this year are uh, in need of someone helping them to get their books together. And, uh, perhaps getting their life together along with that. And you've been really great with that for me, as well as giving me great advice and anything that you don't feel you need to answer or should answer, you defer it to the CPA, right? Absolutely, yes. Or you go check it for me and yeah. then come back with the answer. That saves me a lot of time. Yeah. And it certainly saves me money because the CPA, of course, uh, is pretty busy and in depth with the tax taxes that's going on. So we want to talk a little bit about what your services are and how people, how you can help other people. Okay. Well, I do bookkeeping for personal or business. Um, definitely, like you said, the interface between personal or business bookkeeping and the CPA. So if I can keep your books tidy and clean and accounted for accurately, your expenses, categorizing, making sure your inco income is accurate, making sure that if it's income that should be taxable versus income that maybe you as a person donated to your business, um, that definitely helps the CPA when they go to do your year-end taxes. Mm -hmm. um, and the less time they have to spend on your bookkeeping definitely saves you money. Um, but uh, any bookkeeper, any CPA, any accountant is only as good as the information that we're provided. So good record keeping is definitely a two-way relationship. It's an essential thing. Yep. Yep, and the more source documents you can keep, whether it's receipts, bank statements, um, accurate uh, counting and memos, even on just the checks that you write, is all very helpful. You keep me very organized is where it's at, and that's what people need today with the busyness that's going on today, and I perhaps believe there's a lot of people that could use that service out there today. And uh, with, uh, again, as far as the financing going is going to, some people are struggling to keep their payments up and some of them are, are being proactive so they don't get to that point, but it's getting harder for them to make their payments and make them on time. So setting up some kind of budgeting with them, are you good to do that as well? I love to budget. And my kids hate that about me, but yes. That's your expertise though. Yes, I, I actually, there's a budget app I personally use. Every time I leave a store, I'm putting it into my little app, keeping my own personal budget on track. So I believe that's highly important. So you have some great programs that you could help train or teach yeah. to those who are interested in that? Yep, yep. Paying and off debt and helping to get interest down and yep. Those kinds of things. Yeah. I think one of the great things that I appreciate is because I get farther and farther away running and doing what I'm doing and you will bring it to my attention one way or the other. Uh, what we do is, what we do to, to get that under control is to try to set regular meetings. Yes. And that way I put you in my book, so calendar, so that we have that time set aside and that's unbreakable, unless it would be an extreme emergency. It's unbreakable so that we meet face to face and I think that we get more done that way. Yep, and then I can ask you the questions that if my questions get too old, like two months away from where I'm asking you, hey, what was this or what was that expense for? What was that deposit? You're not going to remember. So the more current we can stay, definitely the more accurate your records will be. Mm -hmm. and, and you're very reasonable on your charges. Well, I hope so. <laughs> I'm not trying to gouge anyone. Very but. competitive. Uh, 
it's not overextended. Like you, you, you do a, a fairly uh, a good accountability for everything. You, well, you do an accountability for everything. So the, the, it is an affordable thing that people could have. Well, it frees you up. And it, it, it does. And, it, and again, the money that you save from the CPA really does pay you. So if anybody wanted to get a hold of you and have this service, how would they contact you? Um, they could reach me on my cell phone, 248-720-9871, mm -hmm. um, and we could set something up. Are there any other things you'd like to talk about, services that you, you would provide for them or suggestions that you could do for them? Um, definitely organizing. You know, even when we first met, you gave me stacks of papers that I organized and helped you your filing system. Um, definitely I can help with filing, uh, budgeting, as we already mentioned and just preparing a nice clean set of books and records for the CPA definitely is what I We even made sure that there was a spot you could come in when I'm out there and pick up receipts as yep. well, right? Yep. If you just throw your receipts in a folder, a container, something, and hand them to me, that's where I take over from there and get them ready for the CPA. So if you don't like paperwork and you don't think you have enough time to keep all this stuff the way you'd like to, I'm telling you, it's a good feeling to know that it's in order. So I invite you to call Rachel. And you want to give that phone number again? Yep, 248-720-9871. And you're going to love her. See you later. Bye.